This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final, only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Lee Dixon. It is Tottenham Hotspur taking on Liverpool. Well, hundreds of millions of people will be tuning into this one. Probably the biggest club game in the world. Pointed end of the tournament. Who's going to come out on top? Well, Derek, we're just about to find out. Very, very exciting. Number 20, Yelling Alley. on the Champions League stage the more you think Lee they have a chance of lifting that cover to trophy yeah there's a few more pieces of the jigsaw to go in for me but they are a team to be reckoned with every part of their team is emerging as a real talent and put them all together you've got a good team introducing the Spurs starting 11 Toby Alderweireld plays with Davinson Sanchez in the middle of the defence and in attack the always dangerous Harry Kane Thank you. Thank you. starting lineup for Liverpool the highly rated Brazilian Alisson begins between the posts. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joel Matip in central defence. Mohamed Salah plays with Sadio Mane out wide. And leading the attack today is the ultimate pressing machine, Roberto Firmino. And Dele Alli heading in the right direction. And he's beaten. And a chance for them to notch in front. And that was a heaven-sent opportunity to take the lead so early. First goal is so important, Derek. Sometimes you're not ready. Well, you really must be ready this early in the game. Well, sometimes there's no great mystery in terms of a team's preferred style and the visitors do like to press high it's very much their game Lee would you expect to see more of that yeah I think it's their preferred option for sure It'd be interesting to see a real opening now Mane should he really have taken on the shot from that acute angle Lee you're judged by your play on the pitch and some of that play is decision making and he made a poor decision there Henderson Wijnaldum Firmino Now Mane Can he give them the lead? He's gone for power but might be regretting that now Lee Oh my, why, how, so many questions Robertson Mane it's a highly promising Liverpool attack but will there be an end product Mane Keeper didn't quite do enough and the counter attack is on options available 
And an example of a counter-attack that went nowhere. Beautifully disguised ball. Son. It's with Fabinho. It's with Roberto Firmino. It's with Fabinho. Liverpool obsessed with finding a forward gear. Now, what can they do from this position? Well, they're going to forge ahead. Well, you have to say, he's going to be very cross with himself. Well, how's he missed it? It should be the first goal of the game. Well, he's disappointed with the fact they haven't taken the lead, but he'd be pleased with the way they're playing. Henderson. This is Salah. Firmino. Great opportunity. A goal this is. The first important statement in this final made by Liverpool. Well, we've got the biggest club competition in the world, and now we've got our first goal. Well, here it is again. It looks a simple goal. He gets in a position not that far out from goal, but he has to hit the target. He does that, and it's in the back of the net. A chance to revisit the goal. Underway once more. Liverpool have the lead. Number 14, Jordan Henderson. An important interception. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Oh, surely. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, he knows putting his team two up would have been a big, big move in this game. Over the top, into the stride of Sadio Mane. Space and time for the cross. Firmino. Can he... Wonderful chance! Almost what you might call a jaw-dropping save. Oh, he's got no right to make that save. It's absolutely fantastic. Mane. Crossing possibilities. He must finish! Decided to take on the shot from a difficult angle. Well, the blood has gone to his head. He should be picking out a better option there. Extremely sloppy in possession. Is indicated. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Now, Son. Harry Kane losing out in that little battle. Half time then, 
And we're sorry for the pause in the proceedings here, Lee, because this has been a thoroughly riveting Champions League final so far. Well, it has. Great game. Sometimes finals can be cagey affairs, but not this one. Let's hope Derek in the second half we get more of that. It's been really, really entertaining. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. And that was a very fine read. Couldn't hang on to it. Kane. Kane. And options in the centre. Well, great read there to intercept. It's a highly promising Liverpool attack, but will there be an end product? And no joy as far as the cross was concerned. And the Liverpool throw in forthcoming. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. To be replaced by number 23. Christian Eriksen. Henderson. A chance to whip it in. Henderson. And Mane in the thick of things. Just what the Liverpool fans wanted to see as they extend the lead to two goals. looking at replays you get to see the goal in all its glory just look at this perfect header what a goal well the goal again albeit from a different angle It's going their way, 2-0. Goal from Liverpool. Number nine, Roberto Firmino. Harry Winks now. Ericsson. Now Harry Kane. Kane. Magnificent defending. Well, Liverpool certainly enjoying the lion's share of possession. It's important to have strong, dominant players in your midfield, and they've got that. Just look at what that control gives you. Son. Eriksson might really be able to trouble them here. Chance to make a game of it here. And the shot decidedly lacking accuracy. Well, he had other options as well, but he chose to shoot. Wijnaldum now. Lost possession. Now Harry Kane. Aurier. Eriksen. It looked as though he almost forced the shot that time. Well, it's OK shooting from there, but you have to test the keeper. And a change for Spurs at this juncture.
couldn't keep the ball. Ericsson. What a shocking pass, really. 15 minutes remaining. Alexander Arnold has it. Now Mo Salah. Roberto Firmino. Henderson. Can he put it away? I must say, he's let himself down with really flabby finishing there. Yeah, he wasted opportunity from the short distance. You see the manager's frustration on the touchline. And that's an important intervention. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. And teammates to play it to. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Typically tigerish tackle from Jordan Henderson. And only two minutes remaining here. And very deftly cut out. An authoritative challenge. Because Mora. Well, here's a useful looking ball. Suffice it to say, his edge is blunt. Poor effort. Well, he got a lot right there, but he got one thing wrong, and that was the finish. And the final whistle, the cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. And Lee, memories are being made. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't matter how much money you've got in the bank. Players will always look back at moments like these. These moments where you pick trophies up and win medals. Absolutely brilliant for this group of players. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. And now, as a player, and in this case, as a Liverpool player, You've got to prepare yourself for the trophy lift. Well, yeah, this is where you want to be the captain. Sometimes it's a hindrance because everybody's looking at you for a bit of inspiration. But you get to do this. You get to pick up this magnificent trophy and celebrate with your teammates. Liverpool this year have painted Europe red. It's official now. The kings of European club football. Liverpool. Well, certainly the red half of Liverpool and Merseyside will be celebrating tonight. Not so sure about the Everton fans, but even they might celebrate a little bit. Well, this is the moment I love, sharing it with the fans. The ticker tapes coming down, the families in the stand, giving them all a wave. Well, they've travelled all over Europe watching this team. Now they get to share in this moment. Fantastic. took fire as well as ice on the pitch well they've come together in this competition as a team and they're celebrating together now fully deserved and you are looking at the best club side in Europe And a chance for them to nudge in front. 